Thank you for subscribing to the channel. It means a great deal. For those who haven't subscribed yet, only take you a second, hit the subscribe button, share the video, like the video, share the channel with your friends. Um, it all goes a long way with me. And it's an extremely important time of the year for many of us. It's when many of us get our biggest sales. And this can go on for, well, it can start now. It may have even started for some of you. It has for me on certain books and I've, well, certain seasonal books. And I put them out as a kind of a bellwether, as a kind of um, a marker so that I do know that when people are starting to spend their money in preparation for Christmas, and it's usually with, um, let's say, say low content, but cheaper books, uh, lower price books, lower cost books, stocking fillers, if you like, um, things that they can put in, uh, make the presents up with, make the pile of presents up with quite um, affordably. What I've done is I've put a load of links, well, a few links, in the description below, and it's just in the video information part at the, at the very top. And you'll be able to link to those videos, which I created earlier, which have, some have created last year. And they're all about things like um, how to advertise, get your first advertisements out there. Now, advertising is important this time of the year because you're really up against it. This is where everybody else puts their adverts out. And some of them leave it quite late. Some of them start now. Some of them already started. Um, I've started myself. And what I do is all the, any advertisements that I've had throughout the year that have just sort of ticked over, I pause them all. I pause them all. And there's information in a video on how to uh, create your um, first ads, if that's what you're interested in. And I start afresh with all new ones. And I'll do a manual one and I'll do an automatic one. And um, the benefits of that is, well, the manual one, I'll just put simple links. I might have half a dozen um keywords in there for what the book's about so there's plenty of information there on getting your first adverts up and it is a great time to do that you will be up against it but this is the time of the year when most of you if you haven't sold already stand a really good chance of selling now or if you've only sold a few you may see your sales uh, in some cases skyrocket in some cases at least make a difference so that's, that's without advertising, you know, so if you can push that a bit further and hopefully I'd like to see at the uh, after, the, after the new year, some of you come back and saying, yeah, I mean, that helped, that didn't help or um, I've sold so many more books, I've not sold any books, God bless you. And um, hopefully it's a success story all around. Now, another important thing is all the books that you may have had throughout the year where You've not really done much with them and you've been thinking about changing the cover or doing something with it to sort of brighten it up a little bit. Say from something like this to something like this. So now is the time to do that. But remember, if you've done any um, books and you've used AI and you've not gone back in there, no matter if you make any changes to that, whether that's price, whether that's a new cover, um, to sparkle it up a little bit, you will have to opt for did you use AI generated or AI assisted. So you'll have to put those in because you've gone back in and now you're making changes. Now it's asking you if you left it well alone, then you may never have been asked that question. It may never have been an issue, but there's a link below in the description to um, help you with, with that issue. So what else do you need to do? Well, you just need to make sure your categories are okay. So if you've got categories that are um, not been doing anything for your book and you want to just revamp the whole thing, you're doing the cover, you're doing the keyword keywords, and uh, if you've found any errors in the past and you've never really got round to it, change the manuscript as well. Just give everything a good revamp and get it out there. Throw some advertisements with it if you wish. So what can you expect from G4? I expect a lot. I expect that um, from now on, going right up to it and even into January, because people are getting late deliveries, people are ordering late and then finding that even with Amazon Prime, there may be some sort of backup. And 
that's if someone is with Amazon Prime, but just with general Amazon and the postage, it may, that's if you're using Amazon, you may be using other services, but expect delays in the postage. So expect to see that when somebody's bought something a few days before Christmas, they may not get it for weeks after. It, it happens. And you'll see your sales still going into January quite often. And it's usually a case that um, some people get a lot of money. They get vouchers for books, uh, for Amazon. They get um, a little bit of extra cash in their stockings. And they've, there's something they want, maybe a sequel to a book they've already bought, for, or someone's already bought one for Christmas. Um, so you still see sales in January. It can be quite good. Then February is as dead as a dodo for me. I don't know what it's like for, for many of you, but it really sort of drops off February, March, not really great months. Um, so it's a case of making the most of Q4 and um, going at it. Use this information in this video and um, wishing you the best of luck. Let me know how you get on after Q4 and the new year uh, from this video, whether you've had success, whether you've not. And uh, yeah, I'm wishing you all the best for that. That's it.